Well, uh, back then when I when I started, it was really called rhythm rhythm and blues, but uh, the soul the, the soul terminology came in later on. But uh, what brought me in was a lot of uh, uh, the guys that I saw, like the Moon Clothes and the Flamingos and and people like that. I would see those groups, and also my father sang gospel, and he would sing around the house when I was small. And so I just kind of picked it up like that, you know. Oh, I don't know exactly who was the guy that, that phrased it at first, but the term came about because it was a mixture of what they call rhythm and blues and gospel. And so they, they kind of used that term for uh, rhythm and blues singers who were singing uh, that type of gospel music mix of the rhythm, and they called it soul music. So it came from the, that term. Uh, I don't know if uh, it came out of Atlanta uh, with the stacks and vote uh, people or whether it came from uh, uh, James Brown. Or, I know Ray Charles was, was called a soul singer when he started. So uh, that's kind of where the term came from. Well, it means, it means a feeling of, of, of bringing out from inside what you, what you feel. And it, it has a little bit more of the, say, the screaming and the, 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 the uh, more, it's more up-tempo and more feelings. It has more feeling than the rhythm and blues might have. It's more of a, a like I say, a gospel tinge type of rhythm and blues. It's, it's more, uh, more, more feeling in it from the gut, you know, kind of like blues but a little bit more up-tempo and a little bit more church churchy than the blues might be. So that's what it kind of means to me. When they say soul, you're singing from your soul, you know, from, from feeling. It's a feeling type of music. Uh -huh. More than others? Uh, no, I wouldn't say more than others. I would say it's just a different way of feeling it because uh, the blues has a lot of feeling naturally. But uh, the soul has more of that screaming, hollering type of thing, like uh, uh, Little Richard and people like that, although Little Richard's a little bit more rock and roll. But uh, it just has that Sam and Dave type of thing, and uh, uh, Isaac Hayes and Otis Redding, more, that's more like your soul. Aretha Franklin, definitely, you know, when she started singing the type of songs that she did later on. When she got away from CBS, then she started singing more of a soul type thing, you know. Uh, when she got churchy on what she did with respect and uh, those type of songs.